So here we live. I'll be showing you exactly how to use um, this software that would help you remove images or text from images in a couple of seconds. Okay, so let me get straight into it. The name of the application or the platform is ClipDrop, and ClipDrop has a lot of other tools that I may be talking about in some other videos. Okay, but today I want to focus on the text remover, right? And ideally, what this does, as you can see in this image, right, it helps you remove text from images in a matter of seconds. Now Here's the caveat. It may not be 100% perfect. And also, there is, it's free of charge, right? But if you want a higher definition image, you need to pay for it. So what do I mean by that? I'll move over to the pricing. And basically what this is, the free version allows you to be able to um, use about 400 images per day. You can uncrop. You can, um, what's it called? Um, there's something I'm looking for. Somewhere around yeah exactly so you have about 1024 times 1024 so what this means is that if your image is yeah this is what i'm looking for if your image is higher than 1024 it will reduce it to 1024 so that's the caveat for the free version but if you um subscribe to the full version then you can have the exact size of image that you want okay so that's all for the caveat now let's get right straight into it so how does it work all you do is when you get to clipdrop.co you click on this text remover it will take you to a page like this and it will ask you to um either drag and drop your image or you upload directly okay so i would try two different images right um so let's let's check it out so the first one is I'm going to be trying this one. It's pretty straightforward. Um, as you can see. So, like I said, the actual image size is 3872 times 3872, but it's going to downscale it to 1024 times 365. Okay. So let's just check it out. But if you want to unlock the HD mode, you know, you have to subscribe. So I click on download and downscale. And in just a minute, it's going to remove the text from the image. I'm just trying this live. As you can see, it's done. So, if you want to then edit it to remove more, you could just go over to clean up imperfections, right? It will kind of bring out like an eraser option for you. And yeah, so you can increase the brush size if you want, high quality, if you want it to be high quality, but you have to sign up, okay? So we don't wanna do that now. So we move over here, then let me try to clean this bug again. Clean. And there you have it okay so here it is and if you want to clean this too i'm pretty sure you should be able to also clean this but let's, let's try it out okay so ideally this is how it works okay um let me see if i can I mean, and if you're done with it you click on download and there you have it to download your image right so it's a pretty good tool it's a clean tool you right um yeah case studies over here you can see how um photographers use what is it so yeah like you could and it's not just for text right you could also remove objects people from your um this is, so here's a case study right here is another one and right click on clean um, this, um apologies about that so right if i want to remove this bible for example right so it's not just text let me remove it a bit if i want to remove this just this bible for example i can do that and there you have it okay i'm really sure it's going to remove it so but ideally that's not the topic of this video the topic of this video is to um remove text from images and any text image that you have you just try with this tool and it's going to make it um, come out really good so yeah basically that's it and again just as a reminder if you want to make sure your image is upscaled or funnily enough this actually also helps you to upscale your image right i haven't tried it yet let's try it out image upscaler so i'm just trying to <laughs> i haven't tried this particular one before but if i'm gonna play with it let's let's see how it goes okay and i'm just having fun okay so here's the image right um that we downloaded and let's try to see if we can upscale it let's try to see if we can trick the system okay let's just put it at 2x for now upscale this will be funny if it works 
okay it doesn't so basically that's it so i hope you found this video useful and uh, let me know in the comment section how you're using it and if you know of any other one that we could compare it with cheers